It's a positive attitude that is very important on how you're going to set your goals and how you're going to drive yourself towards financial independence. Um, I've got one of my friends, he comes to me, you know, and then he says that, uh, you know, guys, I'm just going to choice you. We're going to do this. And after that, we're going to choice this. And everybody's saying yes. You know, he has got such a positive attitude to life that everybody will say yes to everything that he says. But later on, after thinking, like, what is the choice? Then he says it means nothing. But with the confidence and the attitude that we came with, we all thought schweizing was something that we knew, but we didn't know anything about it. But because of his positive attitude and confidence on what he was saying and everything that he does, everybody listened to him. So, as far as financial independence is concerned, your attitude about money or towards money should be a positive one. It's not you to ask yourself, uh, who am I to be rich? Who am I to have enough money? It's actually, you're supposed to have it. You're supposed to have the money and to have a life that is so good. So, your attitude should be positive. There was a certain person who told me this. If all the money in the world was divided equally among all the populations of the world, after some time, that same money would end up in the same hands of the people that are rich. Why? Because they have a positive attitude. And those who were broke will remain broke even if they were given the money. And those who were rich will become rich again when the money is all done circulating in the economies. So it's your attitude that is very important. Change your attitude about money. It's not a bad thing. It's a good thing. It makes your life quite easy. Thank you very much. My name is TJ and this is Financial Motivation.